Hey, what's up guys, I'm from BST Tech. In today's video, I'll show you how to deep load Windows 11 in order to improve the overall speed. Uh, the app is basically developed by this uh, developer. Uh, the website is freetimetech.com. You can download uh, the app from their uh, website. I will add the link in the description below. Credit goes to the developer who have made it very easy for users to run a single line command. And once the file is downloaded, you have to extract it. And uh, within this folder, you'll find almost 10 files. You have to remember that you have to run this file as an administrator. Right click on that and run this as an administrator. And after that, you will see the basic interface. Very simple and uh, straightforward in order to use. Uh, here we have a couple of tabs. The developer has done a good job and he has combined essential tweaks. These are the first three tweaks which you can uh, use uh, uh, every now and then in order to speed up your PC. Uh, let's talk about in uninstalling the OneDrive. Click on that and then click on run script. After that, wait for the output to show you the result. So output will show you the results. Disabling OneDrive, uninstalling OneDrive, operation is complete. Disabled and uninstalled OneDrive. If you want to reinstall, just click on the reinstall OneDrive and run the script. It will reinstall OneDrive back to your system. Click on Cortana tweak, search. And as you can see, we have here, we will basically run the tweak and we'll disable Cortana and we'll wait for the output to show us. Disable Cortana, that was fairly quick. Disabled and operation complete. Now we'll move towards the essential tweak, which is the main feature of this software. Uh, you can read through these uh, notes and uh, you can edit them if you want, but we will simply run the script and we'll wait for the output to give us the detailed summary. So that was fairly quick as well. Uh, showing known file extensions so here's the list of the operations it has uh, performed you can go through one by one network tweaks and uh, svc host and disabled news and interests and it's done a couple of tweaks in the background operation completed essential tweaks are done after that you can restart your pc and uh, you'll find major difference in overall speed so guys uh, that's it for today's video on how to deep load windows 11 you can use this software on windows 10 as well it will work absolutely fine. So enjoy this new software and I'll see you soon with another video. Till then take good care of yourself. Have a good day. Bye-bye.